Hi, I'm Lance Corporal Clayton Filipovich from the Corps Report, and I'm here with the gear. Now we're at Joint Base Langley Eustis, and we're about to figure out what it takes to get toasted like a bagel. But first, let's learn a little bit more about the active denial system. So right behind me is the ADS system, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna go on the ship and find out what really makes it bring the heat. So this is where the ADS system is controlled. It's very cramped, small, almost like my living quarters in the barracks. Just kidding. But for real, this is very, very cramped. So the guy's in here, he's controlling the monitors. It's got it pinpointed all the way down to small little crosshairs. And it's really impressive. Probably the coolest thing about this little getup is the Atari-like joystick that they use to control the system. And I'm pretty sure I'd be qualified to operate this system because I'm pretty good at Call of Duty. So you've got the two monitors right here. You could probably play split screen. I don't know, we'll have to ask about that. It's very cramped and I'm a little claustrophobic. So I am gonna go ahead and leave this to professionals and get out. I'm ready, sir. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. So, sir, I've seen this operated on one person, but how does it measure up against a crowd of people? You can use it in a crowd to move a crowd from one area to the other. That's the beauty of the system. You can actually sweep from left to right, start on one end, and you can get them in the direction that you want to go. So it's very useful to the commander moving people in a specific direction. So it's a very effective weapon that has a very broad range of, of things they can do. And at the same time, it's non-lethal. It's not going to kill Absolutely. you. So for the people that think, oh, I'm going to be roasted alive, as soon as you get out of the heat, your skin's fine, you feel normal. And That's I, correct. I really like that, that about the system. Yeah. Some people think that the Marine Corps is all about dropping bodies, but that's just not true. In fact, the Commandant of the Marine Corps, General James Amos, is the Department of Defense's executive agent for non-lethal weapons. Non-lethal weapons are the future of keeping our service members safe. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you on the next installment of With the Gear.